Picking County Road 13 south to the town of Eugenia, the entrance to the park is located diagonally across from Eugenia Falls Emporium. The Emporium is a must stop for travelers who are looking for food, refreshments, or gifts. In fact, we decided to take a break and have a little lunch. Fueled up and ready to go, we headed across the street to the parking area and trailhead for Eugenia Falls. Well, Brian, we got talking earlier about uh, people asking you after you've seen these falls, which one is your favorite one? And I got to tell you, if I, I, I don't know if I can actually say the favorite, but it's got to be right up there in the top. This is absolutely gorgeous here with these rock walls coming down the way they are and dropping down beautiful double fall back in there and tremendous, tremendous. Eugenia Falls? Yes, we're in Eugenia and uh, this is Eugenia Falls. Okay. It's our highest waterfall at 98 feet, about 30 meters. And it's one of the highest in Ontario as well. So very significant. Not usually a lot of water, but a very dramatic setting. As you pointed out, the valley is just spectacular and the, the scenery is half the fun here. Now, oftentimes as we've been looking at these falls, they're being named after people. Is this the same way? It is. It's uh, named after the Empress Eugenie, which uh, was a consort of Napoleon III. It was actually named, this area was surveyed in the, in the late 1940s and an ex-French soldier uh, was on the survey party and he, he thought it should be named Eugenia after the Empress Eugenie. Okay. It, Eugenia Lake is nearby here too, isn't it? It is. And yeah. this is where the water is flowing from then? Yes. Uh, this is the Beaver River. It flows down from Lake Eugenia and over the falls. I noticed too, they've really got it fixed up nice. We've got a little retaining wall here, which is real nice because I'm telling you what, it drops over the side and it actually starts right at the precipice of the falls themselves and then works its way down so you can get different views like we're doing right now. So uh, just a tremendous area to come into. The trail follows the escarpment for a short distance before looping back to the starting point. 